Ah, oh, it's not plugged in. Oh, another call's coming in. Quick. Hit the button, Eve. Hello, Detective Agency. Hi, guys. I'm the manager of the RT Five Aside soccer team. We've got a bit of a problem. They don't look very sporty. Shh. Shush me, shush you. We really, really need to ramp up our skills. Is there anything you can do to help me? That all sounds really interesting. We'll go back to you ASAP. You ready for this? Game ball, Neve. Game ball. Right, so how are we going to use science and technology to solve this one? I think this answer is all about data analytics. So finding better information to give to managers, that means they'll make better decisions. Better info means better decisions means better results. I like the way you're thinking, Neve. OK, you go take a look at that, and I go look at injury prevention. Perfect. Cool. Don't know if this works. So here's what we know. Every player in a football team needs to be fit. So let's go into the FAI and talk to the head of fitness there about what information he provides to his management. Okay, Dan, I need to find out all about fitness analysis. Can you tell me a bit about that? That information is collated using the GPS software, and the software then will give us a lot of information, such as the total distances that the players have covered, the number of high-speed running meters that they've covered, the number of accelerations and decelerations. And then afterwards, we obviously have all the data from the GPS analysis, we have what we have seen and what the coaches have seen, and then we have the players' feedback as well. So we put all of that together. From that information, you can design training sessions that will prepare your players for a match. We found out everything we need to know about analyzing fitness. What about the opposition? So, Jer, how do you analyze the opposition? Okay, so the first thing we do is we look at the fixtures that they've played. So in most cases, teams will play 10 to 15 games a year. We take each game, we break it down into how they defend, how they attack, how they transition from defense to attack and vice versa. What I do is pull all that information together, we have a look at it and we get a trend. Is there certain things that they're doing in every single game? Okay, so let me just get this in my head. You figure out who Ireland is going to be playing against over the next few months, and then you break that all down into different pieces and you put it together in a report. But who gets all that report? Well, the first uh, part of the report that's given is given to the managers. They will get reports of all of this on an app, which is called Sports Tech Player. That's what the first thing. Then we give them a report, which will have everything about the opposition. What we also do then is we make all that information available to the players. We have an app here called Huddle. They just click on the Huddle app, and they have access to all of the games there. Right, it's time for Phil to do his job. Our kit man, we're a sports science technology company with a focus on injury prevention. So our goal is to increase uh, player availability and reduce unavailability rates. And what kind of teams and players do you work with? We work across a number of leagues, including the NBA, NFL, we work with Irish rugby, a number of Premier League soccer teams as well. So from the athlete's point of view, obviously they want to stay fit and healthy as much as they can. The more they stay on the pitch, the better they're going to perform. And then for the club themselves, obviously the, the greater squad depth they have and the, the greater amount of players available to them, the more likely they're going to be successful in terms of silverware and league position. So how does Kitman collect all that data? So we have a, a mobile app on iOS and Android that athletes can put the information in. It's very simple, so most of the scales are just 1 to 10, and then there's things like a body map as well that allows the player to rate a particular area of stiffness so the coach will know this straight away. Cool, so if I have, like a, I have a sore shoulder, I can go, oh, it's a bit stiff today, and you tap on the shoulder, put it in, the coach knows I'm not 100%. Exactly, and the coach will know about that straight away and be able to treat you appropriately if needs be. We're very much the team behind the team. We don't impact how they work because their knowledge of their athletes and their expertise is what's the, the important thing. OK, Phil, I've got our client on the computer. Let's deliver our answer. OK, we found out lots of info to help you. First, Neve went to the FAI to look at data. Lots of data. Tactical data, fitness data, even opposition data. Then I sent Phil to get even more data. Data on players, data on injuries, lots of data. So that's the answer. If you get better data, you make better decisions, and your team gets better results. You're welcome. Well done, me. Well done, me. What? Well done, me. I found the answers. Well done, me. Well done, me. No, well done, me. Well done, me.